All right, hi guys. Here I go. I am going to customize my coldest water bottle. I've already drawn out my pattern that I want to do um, in a watercolor pencil so that um, once I'm done, it'll just wipe off if there's any um, like extra pattern bit that I didn't use over my pen. Um, I've tested my pen on the bottom of the bottle and then I tried to wipe it off to see if I could um, fix any mistakes and I really can't. It leaves a, a big smudge. So um, basically once, once I've put the marker down, it's down permanently. So I'm going to start on this side. Just want to thank the sponsor of Coldest Water for sending me this bottle. As soon as I saw it and I knew that they were going to send me a bottle, I 100% had it in my head that I was going to customize it. Um, so if you want to customize your own water bottle and buy one for yourself, promo code DON10 to get 10% off your entire uh, order at coldestwater.com or there are the links in the description box below. You can just use those. Um, there's a link to the giveaway. So if you want to try to win a coldest water bottle, that's where you go. You can do that once a week. Um, you can do that even after my um, promo time here is over. Um, today is the last sponsored video, at least at the moment. And I'm really nervous to do this. I want to do it. I've, I'm excited to do it, but I'm really nervous. So here goes nothing because once I put it down, there's no going back. Okay, so here we go. I have to be really careful not to smear. I have to be careful to let it dry before I turn it over and around. So there might be some drying time in here. If there's drying time, I'll do answering questions or something. Um, I spent a lot of time thinking about what pattern I wanted to do. I really felt like I wanted to do this mucha. I like this sort of um, sea urchin thing that I did um, on one of the Russian nesting dolls. So I decided to do that. It's just going to be blue with the black background. I'm not going to try to do any shading or anything. Okay, do this so I don't get my hand in it. This has been fun to have a, a sponsorship. Um, little nerve wracking, trying to make sure I've planned out videos that work well with having to show the water bottle because, you know, I zoom in. So um, it was a perfect opportunity to use those nesting dolls so I could zoom out and um, and show the product while I was working. A bit of a challenge. Not gonna lie, but I think I think it came out good. <sighs> Should have my fan going. So I could blow on this. I 
And if you're wondering what I'm using to set it on, I'm just using a piece of this corrugated um, foam that I have in a few places. Um, trying to help with the echo in here. Uh, I used to have them all up on the walls. I, 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 once I got my um, my microphone, I took them down because I really didn't like them all over the place. They're kind of unattractive, but I felt like I needed them when I didn't have a microphone. Okay, that's good. Is this part over here? Oh, uh oh, lost my lid. Dry enough. Okay, it's dry enough that I can turn. Okay. I was just worried that I would smear when I turn. Uh, this one's on top. I'll do this one first. Like that. And then this one comes down here. Like so. I suppose I could have um, shown you my process of, of designing with my color with a watercolor pencil, but to be honest, I mostly just drew it straight out the way I've just done it. I didn't do a lot of planning. On the other side, I did. Um, I had a different pattern on the other side, and I decided I didn't like it. I was going to do one... I'm just grabbing my lid. I was just going to do one um, organic pattern on this side and then on the other side I was going to do a more structured pattern but I drew it out and then I didn't really like it and then I thought well that's kind of silly why didn't I choose my plum lay pattern which is you know my pattern I should put that on my bottle it's my favorite pattern that I've done step outs for just giving it a little blow I'm going to make sure it's dry enough that it's not going to smear when I turn it around. That looks good. Okay. And so, yeah, I decided I'm going to do that pattern over here. Uh, which one was on top? I guess I need to start left to right so that I don't smear anything. I'm going to try not to set this down because <clears throat> I really don't want it to smudge. I'm going to go left to right, maybe top to bottom. Just like that. Not sure how well the double line is going to go. Well, that worked all right. To be really careful with these lines. Because these pens are not very th thin either. I really need a... I think Posca makes a even thinner tipped. This one is a 3M. I think they make a 1M. It's going to be one of those things I'll have to track down. Okay, 
Wow, it looks white on this camera. That's weird. It's not. It's blue. It's the same color blue as this. That's weird that it looks white on the camera. You guys can see that even though I'm already drawn it out, I still tend to draw the pattern the way I want to, to draw it. With the, the five arms first and then the petal. And I like drawing with these branches, whatever these branches are. Oh, I forgot this branch. Oh, well. That's all right. Come out from behind. So far, so good. Uh, which one do I want to do next? I think I want to do this next. This one's in front of that one, so I'm going to draw this one next.
Okay. I think I'm done. I'm going to let it dry really, really well before I, um, before I try to rub off the white uh, pencil. You can still see it in there, see it? But there it is. I have customized my coldest water bottle. Now from a distance, if somebody else has one, they know for sure. Yes, they know for sure that this was mine, being as how it was engraved from the company. But if you had it this way, sitting on a shelf or something, now you really know it's mine because from a distance, that is unmistakably my water bottle. And I am so happy with it. I want to thank Coldest Water for sending me this bottle. Um, and for sponsoring my videos the last few weeks. I really appreciate it. Um, I feel a little awkward maybe uh, sometimes um, with the whole promo thing, but there it is again. Promo code DON10 to get 10% off your whole order. Um, I've really enjoyed myself uh, doing all these different kinds of videos in between regular videos and I'm going to continue doing some different things in between regular videos just because it mixes it up makes it more interesting for me makes it more interesting for you but uh, I am going to go back to more of a close-up put my put my paper back down so I get uh, not so far off of my desk and um, hopefully my viewfinder situation will improve a little anyway you guys have a great day um i will see you on the next video whatever it's going to be it'll be on a monday right this was the last one was going to be a friday yes yes indeed um if i end up with a chunk of time where i'm not able to record i might have a few days off for a vacation um, because I'm going to actually be traveling for the next two weeks. Um, and I'm not sure I'm going to get enough videos uh, put into the system to have a video for every day. So if there's a missing one, I'm, I'm okay. I'm just on vacation. I'll be fine. Um, I, I'm trying not to. I'm trying to record a bunch ahead. But if I'm missing one, that's where I am. Don't worry about me. And I will see you on the next video. You guys have a blessed day. Go out and do something nice for someone today. And um, yeah, make the world a better place one person at a time. I'm just going to tip this this way so you can see it. All right, you guys have a great day. Bye-bye.